know, you guys must get someone who, with courage to just do a documentary about Cyril. Um, Cyril didn't attend Mandela's inauguration because he was angry at Nelson for not putting him as a deputy president. Because the Oppenheimers have been touting him that he will be Mandela's deputy president. He, the Cyril has been um, uh, self-seeking and he has been saving the the Oppenheimer and the Minel family and all of them with loyalty and not now from the 70s from the 70s Cyril has been working with these people Cyril went to establish a new a NUM a union of mine workers without being a mine worker Cyril has never been a mine worker Cyril has never been underground a mine he went to school to do law when he came back, he served as a legal officer in the Oppenheimer family. Then there was a commission of uh, investigating black workers' conditions or something like that, which came with recommendation that unions of black workers must be recognized. Upon realizing the Oppenheimers that now these people are going to be recognized, they're going to cause a problem, sponsored the formation of the NUM. For some reason, he found himself in the UDF, then in the reception committee of Nelson Mandela. So when Mandela walks out of Baltimore prison, you must look at that video. You don't know whether Cyril is a bodyguard or what, but he's there I, giving the car direction. By the wall, is the one who's holding the mic. This guy is infiltrating Nelson. When Nelson arrives, sleeps one night in Soweto and then comes back to jo I mean, comes to Johannesburg. With which money? From where? And then he stays in the Minel's family house. Now, the Minel are one of the big mining uh, families in South Africa. So when you say he stayed in Minel's family house, you're thinking, oh, maybe it's a complex. Uh -uh. Same house. He meets Minel's children on the passage wearing gowns. Minel's child, when Mandela passed on, said, yo, we used to see the names we see on TV at our house because these people used to come there and meet Nelson. He moves from Minel, he goes to Sexen Hotel, he moves from Sexen Hotel, he goes to Houghton. We who have been working, we have now been to prison. When we buy houses ourselves, we get question: how can Mandela buy a house in Santin? Mandela bought a house in Houghton. With which money? Why did Mandela get a money to buy the house? This one, Cyril, was at the center of compromising Nelson. So if there is anything that white establishment and the Oppenheimers in particular have on us, is Cyril Ramaphosa. So then, would a Paul Mashatila be a better candidate for you? Well, it's not a better candidate. Um, it is More the acceptable? It, 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 no, it is the ANC to make that decision. But Cyril's relationship to what we have now as a country as a problem he's deep rooted into it the Oppenheimers are forming a political party every day in South Africa just to upset the system because in their reading of situation they like the EFF is going to emerge and pass the DA and merged with the ANC they've got a majority it's undesirable they write there uh, in their website that no this this is not a require it's not a desirable situation so what do we do let's fragment the the black vote what are the, the the things that you look at in financing rise signs because that guy has got no history of mobilization of anything except being an editor of a newspaper you give such a person 50 million and you say no is donation it's not donation it's a formation of a political party and then there is a that lady who was a, a speaker here in in johannesburg mm -hmm. sarah hey, well, is, Sanur is doing sarah we wake up in the morning sarah has got posters poster correct poster it's very expensive where did she get the money she was struggling here with us in johannesburg then you've got her man mashab with no idea what he's doing he gets given 15 million every 20 million all these monies 
of different political parties, including the DA, come from one family. And then this family just divided around their individual granddaughters, uh, uh, the daughters, and then they distribute it as if it's their individual money, but it's one family. Why? The Oppenheimers are the people who formed the political system in South Africa. Actually, the Oppenheimers were members of parliament when parliament started in South Africa. So this was designed by all of this that we found was designed by them. Then they took a decision to get out and to do business. Now they feel they must still control the political space. At the center of that is Cyril. Whatever happens, Cyril must continue this. All the problems we had, Guptas and all of that, that's fine. Cyril wins to be a president of the ANC. Everybody who had a BEE deal, which has nothing to do with Zuma, has got nothing to do with Open Amas, on the basis of what you are bringing to the table, you have been accepted in whatever company you may think of. When this guy came, all those guys were, were dismissed. Were dismissed. The, today is very difficult to find a black African millionaire because. If they had a stake in this coal company which was supplying uh, ESCOM with coal, they are taken out. Why? We don't need you. have got the president. Who, the president is on a speed dial. And then you want to subject us to that another five years of that suffering. 